everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Romance Angels Friday where we use the Romance Angels deck because who doesn't like to start the weekend with a little bit of romance. Oh, look at that. I just opened it up to Wedding and it is safe for you to love and Wedding is my union card, so that's kind of amazing. Okay, you guys, let's see what we have in store today. It really feels like this week has been full of transformation energy. Um, that there is a new start coming, a new beginning coming for you, for your union, for your sacred partnership. Um, but, you know, it's all about your choice. You choose through the energy that you embody, that you emit, how you create your future. So there's potential for a new beginning, but it's all about allowing the transformation to take place, allowing yourself to transform, choosing that timeline, choosing that love, allowing yourself to let go of the blocks and open up to love. Okay. Um, let's see what we have for today. Spirit, what do you want us to know for today? October 2nd. What do you want us to know for today? Okay. <laughs> All right. We have, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner that you seek. What, okay. The I'm looking at this image. I'm drawn to the image. And it's been a while since I've been drawn to images like this. What I'm looking at is requited love. Where in the past, it might have felt like you two weren't coming together. Look at the cherubs at the top. Look at how the divine is orchestrating this. Look at how the divine are bringing you together. But only if you allow it. Only if you trust in this. Only if you have faith. And with that man there, it feels like he's making the effort. I feel like there is a revelation that's happening. I feel like there's a realization that's happening. Where maybe the seeds have been planted within doubt. You had a lack of faith. You were feeling disconnected. You were feeling detached. That was making you question. That was making you doubt. I feel like that faith is being restored. And I feel like it's because... Someone is making the effort to show you what you mean to them, to show you how they feel about this connection. Now, you might feel a little bit doubtful. That's not quite the right word. Um, suspicious. That's not the, quite the right word either. You might be feeling a little bit resistant to their efforts because of the past. And they're a little bit hesitant to make the effort towards you as well because they're afraid of rejection. But both of you, it's almost like the divine's like, you don't have a choice now. That's what I'm getting. You don't have a choice now. The divine is really pushing you towards each other. This is requiring both of you to take a leap of faith and acknowledge what you mean to each other. That you could be the one, the romantic partner that each of you have been seeking and wanting even if it has been deep within, even if, the, if there has been denial, even if it hasn't been fully conscious, you have both been seeking each other. You have both been wanting each other. You are each other's match. And there is a revelation or a realization that is happening that is drawing you both together. And you might be a little bit hesitant towards each other. Um, the Divine Matchlin energy here might be a little bit hesitant to reach out, might be a little bit hesitant to make that effort. You might be a little bit hesitant to receive it based on your past, but this is requiring both of you to take a leap of faith together, to take a leap of faith towards each other if you want to renew this connection, if you want to move into the next phase of your union, of your journey, and of this love. It's about having faith that you are each other's chosen. You are each other's one. You always have been. This is about believing in love and letting all of that ego stuff, all of that past, all the conditioning and the patterns and the templates and all of the fears and the heartbreak and the trauma that you experienced in the past, letting that go. Appreciate that for how it taught you, for that what it taught you about yourself but let that go because this is your sacred partner. This is your person. And you have to let go of the past in order to come into that harmony with your person. You have to fully trust each other. You have to fully trust in this love. Love is about opening up the heart, not closing it down. 
and you come together in this harmony and in this union by opening up your heart to each other. And the divine is supporting this. The divine is helping you do this. The divine is helping you release those fears and transform yourself so that you can transform this love. A very gentle, a very tender energy that's coming forth today. I feel like this might take some time. This might take some healing. But you're healing together now. You heal together through faith. You heal together through the open heart. You heal together by coming together in that love and not resisting it, not holding it back. All right, you guys, that's going to be short and sweet today. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful week, and we'll be back next week with more Daily Energy Draws. I'm taking a little bit of a pause next week. I'm going on a little bit of a vacation. Um, I'm actually going away. <laughs> so I'm going on a little bit of a vacation, taking a little bit of a pause. So we'll be back with um, collective readings as I'm able. I'm sending you guys so much love, so much light, and we'll see you soon. Bye.